with composition of functions, it's not uncommon to see a function within itself. A function can be composed with itself. In example one, we have f of f of negative two, also written as f of f of negative two. This means we have f of negative two inside the f function. We can rewrite f of negative two as two times negative two minus four. We know this to be negative eight. So now, instead of writing f of negative two, we can just put the negative eight in there. f of negative eight can then be evaluated. We know f of x to be two times x minus four. So wherever there was an x, we'll put the negative eight. So now we have f of negative eight equal to negative sixteen minus four, or negative twenty. In example two, we have g of x as x squared minus three x, and we need to find g of g of x. Let's find g of x first. Well, since we're not evaluating at a given value for x, we're just gonna rewrite x squared minus three x in for the inside g of x. So with color coding, we're putting x squared minus three x in for g of x. This gives us g of x squared minus three x. Okay, so now we need to find what g of x is, and wherever there was an x, we put an empty space for this x squared minus three x. It's helpful to do it in two separate steps, like this, if we know g of x is equal to x squared minus three x, rewrite it and then write out the function and leave the empty spaces for what we're going to place inside. So g of x squared minus three x is equal to, foiling this out, x to the fourth minus six x to the third plus nine x squared minus three x squared plus nine x. Now we can combine like terms to get x squared minus six x to the third plus six x squared plus nine x. From here we see that there are no more like terms to combine, and so g of g of x is equal to x squared minus six, sorry, x to the fourth minus six x to the third plus six x squared plus nine x.